Howdy, and what's up, the real TKH? This is the White Tiger here, uh, having a little lag issue here, but yeah, it's just because it's my craptastic client PC. But uh, yeah, uh, we're here today to go into your world and ask a few questions. This is probably the third time I've recorded this video, and I'm starting here my little craptastic base, because, uh, just because I can, I don't know. But anyways, let's get started, shall we? Alright. <clears throat> uh, there's, there's a lot of things I want to ask you, but it's just too many answers at first. This here is the portal to Meaty Lock and German Man's cloned world. I'm sure you've heard of Meaty Lock somewhere, somehow on YouTube. But uh, yeah, we got his uh, world installed as well. And as we can see, here's the one that we want to go to. So uh, yeah. Might, might as well make it out on netherrack, right? <laughs> All right, here we go. I do apologize. I really do apologize for the first video. I was using uh, recording software under uh, Linux, and that was the reason why it sucks so bad, because they don't have too many good videos for video capturing uh, software for Linux, but that's okay. Um, oh, yeah. I have to cheat a little bit. I have Morph installed, as well as a few other uh, mods installed on Feed the Beast Monster Pack. And oh my god, there's a bunch of freaking mana creepers. I hate those damn things. Those are worse. Uh, anyways, oh, I took my map off trying to show you in the second video that we have Optifine installed. Uh, I forget the reason why I was uh, telling you we had Optifine installed, but yeah, anyways. Uh, okay, so there's your base. Do 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 do. You traveled a long way to get from spawn point all the way over here to your base. I'm thinking about actually moving the spawn point so that way whenever we step into the portal we can just come right near your base because basically what we're using your world for is sort of a museum, sort of like it, you know, just to see how you built things and how it works and see if we can rebuild it in our own little base or world or whatever. But yeah, here you go. Here's uh in the back of it, of course you know that already. Uh, dang, this thing's already out. It's probably because it's... Well, it's turned on. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's right, because your nether is not connected to our nether, so it won't work anyways. Duh, of course. Such a noob, such a noob. I am, but anyways. Yeah, tree base. Now, first question. Did you use any fertilizer for your tree base at all whatsoever? And if you did, uh, I just picked up some stuff. Yeah. Uh, good old coin of suck. That's what I call it. Anyways, it's a coin of fortune and it just switched places. Okay, whatever. Anyways, uh, oh yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Anyways, let's get back to the questions. Um, you know, the one I was asking is uh, did you use any type of fertilizer? Uh, if you, well, if not, then you probably should, because it would help out a lot. I know you already got tons and tons of crap already, but, yeah, why not? I don't know. I'm not, you should do whatever you want to. Now, see, this is awesome right here, uh, having this stuff down here kind of out of the way. I never thought to do that. That's pretty good for the tree, uh, tree farm, but yeah. Okay, and, all right, got back to my sword here. Don't want anybody attacking me. Oh yeah, and that's your village. That's your villagers in this fax texture pack that had, comes with a sound pack, and the sound pack makes them sound like Star Wars characters from Episode Four, A New Hope, I believe it's called, or whatever. But uh, yeah, there's your villagers all faxed out, and an Elvis-looking dude over there. That's cool. But yeah, oh yeah, the trading post, dude. I did not even know this existed. Th th what a freaking awesome idea this is. Thank you so much for sharing that with us. And, uh, yeah, so let's continue on. Do, 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 do. Yeah, basic machines. I get all that. That's all cool. Now, what is up with this? Uh, oh, I did not mean to do that. Dag nab it. I did. Uh, whatever. Anyways, um, yeah. <laughs> what is up with the carpet here right beside your bed? I just always wanted to ask you the reasoning behind that. But, yeah. Uh, I guess it might have been leftover carpeting. But, uh, yeah. I actually thought about stealing your tools, because this cleaver is just supreme badass. I don't know why it keeps on automatically clicking down to my inventory. I think I got something. 
button I'm hitting, but anyways, whatever. Uh, I'll be sure to put that back. I'm not going to really use it. What the? Whatever. Any, that's another thing I wanted to show you. The sleeping bag. Uh, sorry, so much lag. I apologize. Might be a recording software, but okay, there we go. Anyways, uh, sleeping bag. Go anywhere and sleep anywhere you want to at night. Doesn't matter where you are, you can just go to sleep. Except for when there's monsters around, of course. But, yeah. Man, what the hell was that? Well, whatever. Anyways, uh, okay, yeah, that's the uh, HSLA steel making stuff. Oh, and this happened in your first, in the first video, the one with the, with the flickering. A creeper came by, blew up, and blew that out, and I actually had it, <clears throat> excuse me, rebuild and redo the item thing there, the item frame or whatnot. But yeah, uh, Ender Tank should probably go there, which you already know about since you already know about Ender Tanks. And yeah, clear glass. I've, even though Sfax Texture Pack doesn't make uh, regular glass look like clear glass, they look the same. But clear glass, I found out, he can actually break and get back. So that's really cool. So thank you for that. Uh, anyways, yeah. Uh, other questions, other questions. Uh, those over here, now this is all technological marvels. This is just freaking awesome, all this stuff here. Uh, the uh, farm, and then the animals here. Yeah. I thought I was able to jump and fly with my power suit armor on. Oh well, I guess not. I could have sworn I had installed flight mode to it, so yeah, back to the Brimbra. Okay, and if I can get over this. Okay, there we go. Okay, pigs, cows, sheep, yay. Also want to let you know, thank you so much for letting us know about the uh, drums from extra utilities, even though there's the tanks from open blocks, it's still pretty badass. So, uh, yeah, because it's portable and modular and all that good stuff, even though the open block tanks are too. I wonder what you have in store for this room here. I can't wait, but yes, your s wither skelly room. Now, I'm actually tempted to take these because I'm, there's a recipe that calls for making a wither boss and a sword and a bow or something like that to make some sort of crazy. Oh, it's a nether star box or something like that. I don't know. I'd, I'll probably need those eventually later, but I may not steal them. But, yeah. Culinary generators. Good freaking idea. I'm going to try to use that as well on something eventually. But, uh, yeah. Awesome. Alright, come on. i got to hurry up and make sure this video actually gets going. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Let me the hell out. Ah, son of a... It's because of this stupid Rembrandt thing. Okay, there we go. Okay. Good. All right, now, uh, also, right quick, uh, the farm down here, yeah, the Rotary Craft Farm, although very inspirational and amazing looking and everything, uh, is it really necessary to have all these machines and everything? I mean, really? Like, good lord, dude, there's just so much stuff. Is it really that complicated to get everything going like that, I guess? I don't know, but, okay. That's just cool, though. Either, either way, either case, really all cool. And what's up with him? Uh, does he not get any lube or something like that? Does he need lube? I don't know. Anyways, I don't, I'm not familiar with Rotary Craft yet, so I'm not going to screw with that. Because you got it working perfect, and I suck. So, yeah. Come on, lag. I apologize. Okay, there we go. Alright, and last thing, your rotary craft drill. Uh, God, I forgot where it is. Oh, it's near your nether portal. That's right, it's over here. That's right. I should know this. I've done been over here like two or three times trying to record stuff already, but uh, yeah. Okay, nether portal. Oh yeah, here's the dirt mound where dirt creeper blew up in the first episode that flickers like crazy. I do apologize again for that, but anyways. Going on down here. Do to do to do. Now this down here is just freaking awesome, this drill. Uh, in the second video that I made, which you'll never see because unfortunately the recording, I don't know what happened. It seemed like everything was recording and doing alright and then it just disappeared. So yeah, oh well. But uh, I went down here and I was uh, talking. Oh, by the way, it took me forever because I thought it was down there. I thought it might have been down there, but no, it wasn't. It was down here to the left. 
and I broke it, of course, being the noob that I am, I broke it, so I was just trying to talk to you about it or something, I hit it with my sword, and it all cleared out to here, and there is, hey cool, look up here, I bet you didn't know this existed here, but uh, maybe you did, I don't know, but uh, here's some stuff that you can mine and get, you know, whatever, you know what this is, uh, mining Oh god, I've drawn a blank here. I can't even think. That's terrible. Mining tunnels and stuff. Yeah. Oh, you knew about that. It looks like you knew. Yeah, it looks like you knew about it. Okay, never mind. I'm a derp. Of course. But, uh, yeah. Cool. Alright, so, yeah, you had to have known about it. Okay, never mind that, but... I don't know how to reset it up. I don't know how to refix it. So, upon next world download, I'm going to re-implement the new world download into our server. And, uh, yeah... We really appreciate the world download. It helps us out so much with trying to figure out rotary craft stuff and how to get the beginnings and the basics down and everything. Thank you so much again. Not that your videos aren't cool and everything, but, you know, of course you know they're speedy and uh, it takes a lot of time to sit there and, you know, go back through videos and rewind them and watch them again and see how you, exactly you build things, especially as speedy as it is. Not complaining. Don't get me wrong. Uh, just you know, just a little bit harder, just go back and use his reference, but no problem, it's awesome, I re we really like your videos, so it's all cool, but uh, yeah, Slime Tree Farm, good idea, I'm going to be doing that next, or some sometime soon, I don't know, I have so much crap I want to do and get into and everything, and yeah, alright, so for the moment, let's go back home, and I just, I don't know, I can't think of anything else really to ask right about now. I had a few questions, I probably forgot most of them, but, uh, yeah, anyways, uh, again, thank you so much for providing a world download for us, that way we can actually see what it is, what the hell's going on here, uh, I don't know why, but I just feel like ending the video like this, uh, really hope you enjoyed it, thank you so much for taking time to watch it, uh, it, don't even bother clicking like or anything like that, uh, I don't care, I just wanted to do this just to do a video response to say hey I'm the first one to actually do it haha -ha. but uh yeah anyways um I also want to show you my skin for some reason I don't know why but this is what I look like I don't know I look kind of dorky noobish but eh, it's okay thank you again for taking the time to watch this hope to do this again and we'll see you next time don't stress out over uh the family or whatever because I know how that is but yeah Anyways, take care and keep making videos. I appreciate it. Later!